So this is what I do with even my young dentist. Now, somebody, somebody fresh out of the gate might not be able to pre-block four weeks, but I'm adamant about this with all my clients. You gotta pre-block four weeks. So this is what my wife and I do, and I ask every one of my clients to do this. When I was 26 and I went through all those courses, one of my mentors locked me in a room, and he gave me one of these calendars, these ugly, flat, laminated calendars, and he goes, you know what? I want you to tell me where you're gonna be every day next year. And I was like, this is stupid. I'm not even, I have no, I'm not married, I don't have any kids. What do you mean? He says, no, if you tell me where you're gonna be every day next year, there's a better chance of making that happen. And you know what? I went through the exercise, it was ridiculous, but it was crazy. I actually did everything that I said I was gonna do. And he said, put some wild stuff on there. So that year, Brett Favre was in the Super Bowl, it was in Louisiana, I'm like, well, they go, I'm going. So I put it, and guess what? I went, I went to the game. I sat in the game and they won. I pre-planned it. I wasn't winging it. So every year I've kept one of those calendars. So my wife and I, what we do in September, every September we get the calendar. And September is a great month, why? Because you get the school calendar, right? And you can actually see what's gonna happen. So in September, we get this whole thing, we put it out on the kitchen table, and my wife takes a big fat magic marker and she goes, what about this, 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 and this. And then I freak out. <laughs> Whew, that's a lot, you know? Well, we could do this, 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 and this. And we always do one thing with the kids without any grandparents around. And this is really important. One of my mentors taught me this. When you have kids and you bring grandparents or cousins or friends and they have kids, it distracts from your ability to connect with your kids. And I never got that until I had kids. And so the first time we went to Disney, my kids would hold my hand, they'd walk down, Dad, are we gonna see Cinderella today? You bet we are. Do you know what I mean? You connect with your kids. I have a friend that just went on, a, went on a cruise with all of his siblings and all of their kids. He got back and I was so excited. I'm like, how did your cruise go? He goes, it was great, but I got cheated. Because my kids were hanging out with all their cousins. I didn't even see them, you know? So go on specific vacations with your kids.